Oh, what is up guys, Mikey Tamemo here, and welcome to my YouTube channel, and welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough. The playthrough of the Hushim Baliar, and in this particular episode, we're gonna finally go to Geldern. So, let's wait for the loading screen, and then we're gonna head towards the city of Geldern, which I have to sell, well deliver some gold nuggets, silver nuggets and once that is done the gold will start to flow Let me check while I'm at it how expensive a ranger's armor is. Because I do need to collect it before I'm gonna kill this one or the one with the shadow beast. Because they are the only ones that can actually sell you druid armor slash ranger gear. Twenty seven thousand, eh? I cannot make it yet, but at some point I will. 
quite close to the uh, 27k. Must be a nest around here somewhere. Another one of those beasts. Uh. Well done. Take that, rotten beast. Let's see if we can find booty down here. I doubt it, you know, but every little bit of gold that I can get. Is very welcome. Alright, so Gildan, here we go, motherfucker. Nice bitch, motherfucker. Ten years later.
could do with my next learning points. Now I'm going to keep investing into ancient knowledge. I think that's a bit more important than getting at the actual ballet I suppose. Well, well, relax, he's peaceful. He comes in peace. I call him E.T. Extraterrestrial from the realms of the dead. Yeah, let him have it. Remember to block. My skeleton is being oh. ass whooped. He tried, though. He tried. Well done. Hey, you won't get up again. Gotta give him credit for trying. That is too heavy for me. Here it says something about alchemy. Don't cause any trouble here, got it? Got it. Here it says something about alchemy. I need sulfur. Five lumps. Do you really? Stop yanking my chain, Mora. Get me that sulfur or you'll be sorry. But don't even think about bringing unrefined chunks of sulfur, understand? Here you are. Five lumps of sulfur. Good. Here's a healing potion for you. And now scram. I'm busy. Show me your goods. I could use some mana. Although it will cost me a bit of gold. And I do want to get the ranger armor first so I can assassinate those rangers, collect their weapons, and thus a lot of booty. something on this world that I like its booty Damn it, am I going too slow for you again? When will you idiots finally get it? I need time to supply all of the troops here. You're a fire mage? I used to be. Now I'm the cook for this voracious gang of mercenaries. Now don't tell me you're one of them yourself. I see that you still wear your robe. Yes, in hopes that this nightmare will soon be over and humans will be free once again. Can you teach me the art of magic, even though all you do these days is cook? All right, I will give it a try. A fire mage shouldn't be heard cursing. I've had it with good manners. All I want is some peace and quiet, damn it. That attitude won't get you far in this town. Is there anything worse than being a cook here? Death, perhaps. I am not afraid of dying. I will go down fighting when my time has come. And believe me, there are many here in Geldern who think like me. Tell me more about the mercenaries. The mercenaries work for gold. Gold from the orcs or gold from the humans. It's all the same to them. That's all you really need to know about this corrupt bunch of Cretans. One of them even killed his own people for gold. Which mercenary here would kill his own people? His name is Ivan. He always shoots his mouth off at the orcs. He's more of an unholy bandit than a mercenary. 
Right now, Ivan and his boys are watching a mine north of Geldern. What can I do to help you persuade the humans to fight the orcs? I need to know whether the shamans are hiding one of the fire chalices in their temple. I don't think they are, but it still gives me sleepless nights. Talk to Grok, the senior shaman, and make sure they don't have a fire chalice. Only then will I help you persuade the humans to revolt. Where are the other fire mages? They are in the big monastery in Nordmar, looking for the 12 fire chalices of ancient magic. They hope to use them to restore magical abilities to the paladins. Those chalices must be found. The monastery needs every single one of them, understand? Where can I find the fire chalices? I found some evidence when I studied the history of Geldern. According to what I learned, it seems certain that one of the chalices is located here in Geldern, in the mine. There's another clue pointing to the temple in Geldern, but that one is rather vague. I see. I see, oh yes. Hmm, interesting. Here it says something about alchemy. Let's see if I can make some potions. I don't have the ingredients for that. Welcome to Geldern, stranger. What can I do for you? You're a merchant? Exactly. I deal mainly in artifacts, so if you find any, bring them to me. What do you know about artifacts in this town? There's a storeroom on the fortress on the south side of town where they have some valuable pieces. What artifacts interest you the most? They say that the seven ancient rings of the alchemists are hidden here in Geldern. They're worth more than 3,000 gold on the black market. I would really like to call the Seven Rings of the Alchemists my own. You talk like someone who knows a lot about thievery. I know many thieves. It's part of dealing with artifacts. However, I don't know too much about these things myself. But I heard that Laird, one of the greatest thieves in Mertana, is in town. I know Laris. I could introduce you to him. Would you do that? I wouldn't mind paying 1,000 gold coins for that. I'll see what I can do. Show me your goods. Got the, you got some tablets. Man. Love for you. I love you, man. If they sent you to tell me that it should go faster... What? Never mind. I thought you were here to demand the next delivery for the orcs. Can you sell me some potions? Not just that. I also have some rare artifacts. Interested? Show me your goods. What do you provide to the orcs? I'm an alchemist. What would I make for the orcs? Potions, of course. Those warmongers have an inhumanly high need for healing and mana potions. Alright, so let's talk with the great king of thieves, my good friend Laris.
At last. Best High time you move your butt over here. So, here you are, Loris. On the lookout for booty again? Old habits die hard. That's especially true for thieves. I've got a really big score going right now. I bet this will interest you, too. screwing around. So, where is there anything to be had here? I accepted an assignment from a rich hashishi merchant. He says that the shaman set up six very you valuable golden plates in the temple. Yourself. He wants them, and he's willing to shell out an incredible amount of gold for Doesn't them. Matter to you. you disappeared pretty quickly after we got here with our ship. Sure. I saw the attacking pirates from the Esmeralda's deck, so I decided to make myself scarce. Like that Open battle against anyone. pirates is more your cup of tea. I prefer to oh, fade into the woodwork, right. as you're well aware. Who is this merchant you work for? He's a wealthy hashishi from the desert. Boring fellow, but he's loaded. I see. Will you help me brush up on my thieving skills? <laughs> of course I will. You know that. How much will you get for the shaman's golden plates? A huge amount of gold. Enough for both of us, my friend. I just can't get into the damn temple. <laughs> but I know you'll be able to pull it off somehow. Bring me the six gold plates, and I'll give you a pile of gold coins for them. What do you say? Sounds fair to me. Jared, the artifact trader, would give his right arm just to meet you. I've heard of Jared. He'll give you a decent price. I think I should pay him a visit. Go right ahead. Uh, have we met? I wouldn't know where. I'm an old man. I can't remember every face anymore. You know? I see. You yeah. know? Who are you? Well, let me think for a moment. I think I'm Renwick, aren't I? Yes, my name is Renwick. What are you doing here? I guess, uh, pardon me? I ask what you're doing here. Uh, oh. I almost had it. No, I forgot. Say, are you yanking my chain? Uh, my, uh, what? Brain? Yes, it does get a bit addled at times. You're an alchemist. Yes, exactly. Th that's it. Thank you, son. Now I remember. Yes, alchemist. Can you sell me some potions? Potions, you say? Uh, yes, I think so. Can I help you, old man? Uh, certainly. Uh, uh, what was I about to make again? A potion. Right. It was even a very powerful one. Uh, all I'm missing is a bunch of things. So rare. It's very rare. Yes, it is. Go and bring it to me, all right? Then we can chat about alchemy some more. You mean you could teach me alchemy then? Teach? Oh, yes, yes, of course. I can do that too. I see. Ah, you look familiar. Do I know you? You are the alchemist Renwick, and I am the fellow who has the privilege of getting you King Sorel. Right! That was it! Where can I find King Sorel? What would a man like you want with such a rare plant? I thought I might bring it to you. Really? That would be most charming, son. I think I saw some near the abandoned mine to the south, although I'm not sure. Yes, yes, that's it. Tell me more about the abandoned mine. Mine? Mine? What? What mine? Forget it. Here, I have your King Sorel. King Sorel? Really? Oh, that's wonderful. Then I can devote myself once again to my... Uh, <laughs> you can devote yourself to your potions again. Right! That was it. Take this as thanks, son. Show me your potions. Uh, it could be that I have some. Uh, uh, take a look, son. You gotta stop making potions, old man. You go a bit cuckoo in the man. Uh, 
that's just going to cause more trouble. Well, look here. A new face in my city. Are you looking for work? Who are you? I'm the leader of the mercenaries in Geldern. My name is Samuel. What is there to do in Geldern? Geldern is the city of mines and artifact collectors. We mercenaries were hired to open up and secure the mines around here. And I can tell you that it has always paid off for us. If you're not afraid of honest work, you can earn a good profit here. I want to join you. That's what I like to hear. Then pay close attention. If you follow the road from the north gate of Geldern, you'll find a cave that hasn't been developed yet. Go and see if it's worthwhile to set up a mine there. While you're at it, you might as well wipe out all the vermin crawling around in there. Got it? Got it. Show me your goods. I need the right key. Hey, you. What are you doing sneaking around? Hi. Mm, you're looking at me with the eyes of an experienced warrior. I've never seen such a strong gaze in your weak people, Mora. Show me your goods. An orc with bows and arrows. Well, isn't that surprising? What are you doing here? I'm hunting druids with my search party on the orders of our leader, Grok. I've been told that there's a range of camps south of here. One of them is hiding out there. A really obstinate specimen. They say his name is Torn. You won't catch Torn the druid while you're sitting on your behind. None of that, Nip. Even if you are a fighter, take it from me. You don't want to mess with Ganok, so watch it. I will eliminate the druid Torn for you. Ha! I'll believe that when I see it. Then wait till you see it to believe it. Because it will happen. Pretty sure that was an alchemist ring here. Yeah. Stop! Some valuable things have gone missing here. Do you know anything about that? No. We're watching you. Warning number one. Show me your goods. I talked to Laris. He will get in contact with you. The Great Lairs, here in my shop. That I should live to see the day. Yeah, yeah, get over it. Thanks, friend. Here's the gold I promised you. 
Easiest gold ever made. Where do you think you're going, Mora? Who are you? I am Nemrod. I take care of the summon's needs. Meet them with reverence, or you will feel my blade. I hope we understand each other. What sort of temple is this? These halls are the headquarters of the highest dignitaries of the shamans. Our leader Grok rules the ancient alchemist city of Geldern from here. I want to enter the service of the shamans. Hmm. You're a strong fellow. You can prove your prowess in the mines around here. Or maybe you're good in battle. Then you would be better off with the mercenaries or the gladiators. The shamans accept men who have a good reputation in the city. What are the shamans' needs? We dig for gold, sulfur, artifacts, and other valuable natural resources for them, Mora. The mines have to be productive. That is my job. I want to work for you. <laughs> Normally, the most I'd let a Mora do is bring me a joint of meat, but I think I might have a job for a fighter. I need a new messenger. What would I do as your messenger? You would go to the mines in my name, find out about the missing yields, and bring them to me. And if the mines aren't productive, then you would get them going again. It's as simple as that. Well, well. That's what you call a messenger, huh? Sounds like deadly backbreaking work to me. Do you want to work for me or not? Hmm. Yes, I remember saying something like that. Then stop. What happened to your last messenger? He was eaten by mind crawlers. What will you do in the meantime? Don't get cocky, Mora, or else I'll show you who the masters of this city are. Fine, I'll take the job. Get started already and stop talking about it. What do you need from the sulfur mine? The lazy rabble in the sulfur mine to the north promised me 30 lumps of sulfur. Go and collect them. What should I do with the gold mines? I've been waiting for days for 50 gold nuggets from the mines in the north. Go and bring them to me. I don't care how you do it. Where can I get artifacts for you? We have taken many artifacts from the wolf mine, but the mine is abandoned at the moment. A pack of tunnel wolves ate all the slaves, and the guards too, while they were at it. Get yourself some eager slaves and get the wolf mine going again. The slaves will show you the way to the mine. But before you take the slaves to the wolf mine, make sure the tunnel wolves are gone. Where else can I find artifacts other than the wolf mine? A lot of artifacts can be found in this part of Mertana, around Gildern. So far we haven't gotten around to opening up all of the areas. In the north is an old ruin on top of a crag. Go and see what can be had there, and bring it to me. Tell me something about Zardis. The mage knows the ways of the gods. He bears the knowledge of many lifetimes. He is chosen. Chosen by Beliar to bear his power. Well, actually, he took the power. We are looking for artifacts. At the moment, nothing else is important. Here are your gold nuggets. Good. That should do for now. Here is your reward. Here, I have your lumps of sulfur. I said 30. Are you deaf? Go and get the rest. Yeah, yeah. Are there mines in the south of Geldern? There is an abandoned mine, but we don't dig there anymore. It was no longer productive enough. How many gold nuggets do I have left? 80-ish. Well, that's a bit nice gold. Show me your goods. Not that ma m m much, but you gotta, you know, you gotta enjoy the little things. It's about two k more. For uh, 
the ring you just saw, man. Welcome to my humble business, son of tastefulness. Do you seek goods from the distant desert, or are you looking for rare artifacts? Whatever it is, you will find it here. You sell artifacts? What a curious question, son of puzzlement. Don't you know where you are? This is Geldern, the meeting point for every artifact hunter in the land. Nowhere in Mertana are there more artifact dealers and seekers than here. Even a successful fight in the arena is rewarded with an artifact here in Gelder. Where do you get your artifacts? <laughs> I ask you, my friend. What sort of a businessman would I be if I gave away my sources? You had better mind your own affairs, son of prying. Show me your goods. I have everything you want, son of bargaining. Sixty three ancient knowledge. That means I'm at two. 94 which means i have enough to learn everything so fuck wasting learning points let's let's go which means that i can use the learning points that i get in either hunting or my belial spells like summoning the demon which is one of the things i really really want So basically I can now learn everything, which is good. Army of Darkness will be one of the first things I learn together with uh, Summon Demon. Well, if I get Army of Darkness, then Summon Demon is going to be pretty useless. Interested in rare artifacts, stranger? My name is Hamel. I can offer you the best and most reasonably priced artifacts there are. You're a traitor in the slave quarter? We all do what we can. It is my fate to be stuck in this slave hole. But my goods are top quality, nevertheless. Where do you get your artifacts? Oh, you know, here and there. Things will fall off the back of carts sometimes. In other words, you're stealing from the orcs. Stealing is such an ugly word. We humans should stick together, don't you think? Show me your stuff. We still get about three stone tablets in the arena. So the 300 has been reached, basically. Which means that I can basically, if I wanted to, wield this armor just for its stats, because look at the difference. You know, normally I wouldn't wear it, but uh, since I haven't found a better armor yet, I could wield it. But I'm still doubting about it, you know. Now this is also a very good location to grind the pickaxes 
to grind the hammers as well as the saws at least saws I'm not 100% sure but pickaxes and hammers most definitely which you will need for vanguard I'm gonna get this gold in this mine hey, you uh, there's a uh, fight so I can get myself the ranger's armor and prevent the use of the Adenos rope. Because, you know, Adenos is Adenos. I want to keep my playthrough a bit legit. Hey, Snow! got my ass kicked by a slave. What a shameful day for belly all that would have been. Hey, no, hey, no, there's uh, a fight! No. Uh, it's always the little guy. It's like I didn't see anything. Oh, it's always the little guy. You dare there's a fight. Uh. Cruel gods, they don't even react. Poor slaves. Thank you, God. Thank you for the applause or the clapping. Next time it's my turn. Next time it's my turn. You hit. Uh, uh. So far, no person with a saw, but uh, you can also grind the saw at Travis.
But anyways, guys. Put down your weapon. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, subscribe to my channel. If you do subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell. Provided that you want to be notified on whenever I upload content. And smash the like button if you want f to unlock the Gothic series hardcore run. Which is the playthrough of the Decider. Uh, the most brutal one. He's literally gonna kill everyone. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you guys in the next part. Where we're gonna continue. The obtaining of quests. And completion of quests. Within Galdern. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you guys next time.